Hey everyone, in this video, let's compare Flux AI with Leonardo AI. In order to do so, here we are at flux.ai, flux-ai.io, and also we are logged in here at app.leonardo.ai. Let's go ahead and start with Leonardo because I am a bit more familiar with that. It's something that I do use on a regular basis and I recommend it. One of the reasons being is Leonardo does provide 150 free tokens every day. And uh, that is quite nice um, to be able to use their platform and get used to it. Uh, as far as Leonardo goes, pretty much has all the tools that I might want in image creation. I don't use the video very much and I'm not too familiar with real time gen or real time canvas, but I have used the upscaler and the canvas editor. The canvas editor is very useful for editing your images. If they don't quite turn out the way that you want them, then you can use the canvas editor and uh, it is really quite useful to be able to do that. Um, those 150 credits every day is really nice. The other thing that they've added here recently that I also like quite a bit is their flow state. And with the flow state, you can basically, um, for a single credit, you can generate a variety of examples. And it really helps for being able to see your ideas in different styles. And you can really dial it in, hone it into what it is that you're looking for. Um, so that's something that I use quite a bit, and it's one of the reasons why I keep coming back to Leonardo. Let's go ahead and take a look at Flux AI. And one of the things about Flux is that you are going to find that Flux is integrated in a lot of image generators that are out there, but they do have their own designated site that you can go to as well. And you have the image generator that you can use, and you also have the video generator. Now they do offer a free trial, um, and they also have some free tools. You can uh, convert um, an image, uh, free tools for converting image format. So you can, you can change the format of the image. You can generate a prompt from an image. So if you have an image and you want to get the, a prompt from that, that might help you out. You can use that. Uh, you also have the uh, uh, generate optimized prompts for Flux AI. So if you have, you basically, you could take your prompt from there and then bring it over into the uh, prompt generator and it can improve your prompt. So that's really helpful. And also it has a free image upscaler. So that's pretty useful as well. The fact that that's free is quite nice. Um, that's not something that I have spent too much time with, but I do think I will. And um, as far as the basic uh, tools that it has, you are going to need that subscription in order to take advantage of everything, but it does seem like it has pretty much everything that you might want from not just an image generator, but also a video generator as well. And if you do your research, you'll find that Flux is very highly regarded as far as image generation goes, and it is used um, on a variety of different platforms. So we've got the image generator. We can take uh, go photo to video. Uh, we can do in painting. We can create an avatar. Um, we can uh, recraft uh, our images. We can create anime images. Um, you know, there's a variety of things here. Uh, generate realistic images, uh, create image uh, from Flux Dev LoRa models, et cetera, et cetera. You can see for yourself here all the different options we have. Let's go ahead and take a look at the pricing. And one of the nice things with Flux is that you do get 40 credits for new users and daily check-in is 20 credits. So not quite as uh, generous as Leonardo is in that regard, but the fact that they do offer free credits is definitely a good reason to come and use this. And the other thing being that the quality of their output is, is uh, well known. So that's another reason to come in and check in with them as well. But I do want to take a look over here at Leonardo because I wanna double check here and see, let's go ahead and uh, let's go to classic mode. And I think the best way to do this here is just to throw this on pause here real quick. And yes, I can confirm that Flux is actually integrated 
uh, into Leonardo as well. So that's a good example there. You can see for yourself that uh, Flux is something that you can use on different platforms. So you can always use the uh, Flux uh, website, but you can actually use Flux on Leonardo as well. So those are the uh, main differences. Uh, I do think that going straight to the Flux site and being able to take advantage of those 20 credits is definitely something that if you are looking to generate some images, you wanna try some things out, then it's nice to know that you can do that. With Leonardo, you do get 150 credits, so and you can to get access to Flux as well. So just bear that in mind. Uh, they both have their pros and cons, but I think that for myself, as I said, I have used Leonardo before, and I've tried other platforms, and Leonardo is one that I keep coming back to. So take that into consideration, and that's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment and like and subscribe for more helpful tips.